Hi everyone, welcome back to Sagami Beauty. I'm Krisha. So another exciting video today. I mean, let's face it, talking about makeup, every video is exciting. But this one's extra exciting because I get to go over my love affair for the Chanel Duo lipsticks. Official name, my goodness, La Rouge Duo Ultra Tenue lipsticks. This is my hands down favorite lipstick formula of all time. I don't even know. I don't think any lipstick can beat this formula. It has longevity. It is comfortable. It comes in now even more shades. It is just by far the most foolproof lipstick you will ever use. Now, it used to come in packaging that was kind of round. The shades I have from like way back when that I love because they're way more shimmery are, I don't know, this is like a serious throwback. Coral Peach. Pink Twist, my all-time favorite shade. Oh, why was it limited? Why isn't it back? I, I don't know. I'm so sad about that. And Coral Crush. These all had more of a shimmery tone to them. So I got some new shades I will be going over. I have some from the current collection, but previous releases in this hand. And we'll go over the swatches on the hand. We'll do some lip swatches, and I'll give you my final thoughts. Although, at the end of the day, this lipstick formula, I'm just going to do a spoiler alert. It's amazing. I There's no other lipstick that I reach for when I need it to last all day. Unlike most liquid lipstick formulas that I've used, I mean, I've used the Kat Von D in the past. I've used the MAC liquid lipstick. I've used a bunch, and they're never comfortable, let's face it. I mean, if you need something maybe for nighttime for a certain look, they, for the most part, you know, last. But they're never comfortable. You can never usually wear them two days in a row. These you can wear every single day. You have your color on a sponge side there, which you apply first. You let it sit for about two to three minutes to set. And then you seal the deal with the clear gloss that adds comfort, shine, amazing. The shade range now is so extensive. The new shades are beautiful. A bunch of more new nudes, a ton of reds. Some I believe are limited edition, but when I went on the Chanel website, it didn't give me the ones that are limited. So definitely be careful there. If you're maybe talking to a sales associate that works at the counter, that might be your best source of information because I couldn't find the limited edition shades, although I do feel some are gonna be limited from this new extension. Okay, so before we get into any of the swatches and nitty gritty information, I definitely invite you to subscribe as well as ring the notification bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Let's go straight into the hand swatches and lip swatches and oh, I can't wait to show you guys all of these colors on. Okay, so let's go over the hand swatches. We're gonna go with the newest shades first. So from left to right, the first shade we have is Chic Beige. You can tell it's very, very light, the lightest of the bunch. Then we have Timeless Beige, almost like a warm brownie nude tone. Then the third new shade that I have is Light Mauve, which is my absolute favorite shade. Nothing like it in the line. Just a beautiful, cool toned, mauve pink. And then we go into some of the previous releases. So Darling Pink, one of my favorites, definitely similar to Chic Beige, but a little bit warmer, a little bit darker. Then we have Soft Candy, more of a coral pink, perfect for summer, beautiful, beautiful color. A little bit less wearable, obviously going into fall and winter, but spring and summer, beautiful. And then one of my favorite shades actually is the last one, Chic Rosewood. And this is wonderful with a tan, a very bronzy face and this lip and it looks so naturally chic. Okay, let's get straight into the lip swatches. First one's gonna be Chic Beige. Like I was saying, you wanna put on the color first with the sponge, and then you're gonna let it set for a bit. So let's go straight in. Very nudie pink, almost like 1960s. Let it set for a few minutes, you kind of feel it drying down, but not like really tightening your lips or anything like that. It's been about two, three minutes, I feel like it's set. And then we can go over with the gloss side. And I do recommend doing that. Even if you don't like a ton of gloss, just put a nice thin layer on there. You can always blot some of the gloss off. The color will not come off, I'll show you guys. That's the brush gloss side. and none of the lipstick got onto the gloss brush. It's so amazing, this formula, I can't even get over it. Okay, and that's it. We have the nice glossy nude. 
it's very light, but for a long-lasting lipstick, it doesn't look chalky. It doesn't look unnatural. I really like it with a smoky eye. So, so pretty. Test. We have a clean tissue. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. You guys, I'm not even joking. This is an amazing formula. I, I don't even know what to say. Let's get into the other swatches and I'll show you guys how they look on the lips. I'm wearing my favorite shade, which was the last one, Light Mauve. I love this one so much. It's probably my favorite one in the bunch. What do I think? Well, I love these lipsticks. Absolutely. I think they are a lot of money, like a literally a uh, load of money, $48 Canadian, but I think it's actually worth it in this case. And I don't say that often because I don't feel like makeup is usually worth a ton of money. You know, we work hard for our money, but this lipstick does what it says. It lasts all day. I mean, I can be on vacation and wear it, put it on in the morning, go in the pool, go in the ocean, drink, eat, dance, whatever, and I maybe only have to touch up once. When I go to work, I don't have to touch up. When I go out for the night, I really don't have to. Like, I don't need to touch this one up usually. It would take an extreme situation for me to have to touch up, such as like a holiday day. I love these lipsticks. I recommend them wholeheartedly. They are so worth the money. If you're going to get one product from Chanel, let this be that one product because you will not be disappointed. And I think now with this extended color range they've added, there is really something for everyone. And if you can find a shade that's neutral for your skin tone or the makeup you like to use on a daily basis, you will get so much use out of this lipstick. And you will still use your other lipsticks because I still do, but your go-to will be this lipstick. Absolutely. I can, oh, I don't want to say guarantee it, but I strongly feel this would be your go-to lipstick because of how easy it is. That's it for today's video. Leave me some comments down below. What are your thoughts? Have you tried this lipstick? Are you curious? Um, let me know what your thoughts are after watching the video and all the best to you guys. I'll talk to you very, very soon. Bye.